The Fox and the Ox There once was an ox that came down to a pool to drink. As he splashed heavily into the water, he crushed a young frog into the mud. There was an old frog, and the old frog missed the little one. And here's the story of what happened next. You guys, where is the little one? A great big monster. So, and the little one. Where do you eat? <gasps> Was he as big as this? Oh, much bigger. Was he as big as this? Bigger, 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 bigger. I'm gonna. <gasps> this has gotta be big as he got. The mother was bigger, mama bigger, 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 bigger. I'm gonna. <gasps> So you guys, what do you think was the moral or the lesson that we should learn from the story? I don't know. You don't know? Was the frog big? I mean, was the ox big or small? Big, 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 big. And what about the frog? Small. Small. Could the frog ever puff herself up so big? That she can become as big as the ox? No. No? What's the word for that? She did what she wanted to do the... What's the word where it's, it's like you can never be as, be as big as... I don't know. In what? Impossible. Yay! High five! Impossible. So the lesson of the story is do not attempt the impossible. But the thing is, how do you know if something is impossible or not? That means not going to happen. That is not going to happen. It can never happen, right? The thing is that it's kind of hard to know what is impossible and what is possible. Hello. For example, can pigs fly? No. No? If you think about wings, pigs can't fly. But what if you can bring a pig onto an airplane? Then can it be considered flying? Yeah. Yes. A little bit in a certain way. So this story is to tell you that you need to know your own limit right you cannot become someone else you cannot become someone you're not but the thing is the word impossible sometimes if we think outside of the box the things that ah. seems to be impossible can become possible for example before people did not think that we can fly and people did can't imagine airplane but people will say oh you're doing the impossible or you're doing things that you shouldn't be doing it's a waste of time but the thing is dreamers or people who are inventors they find ways to make the impossible possible so don't let people tell you that what you're doing is impossible right yes. but you do have to know that there is hard limits if if there is a limit, you need to stop. You cannot be like the frog who huff and huff and puff and puff until she bursts, right? Do you want to be like that frog? No. No, but do you want people? Do you want to be prevented from doing new things just because someone say that it's impossible? No. No either. So it's a it's a balance. Okay, it's a hard balance. But remember the story because it has, it's very good, it has a good moral. But also remember to be innovative and think outside the box when you can.